You could never do this. Try to pick up a seed without looking at it. You'll fail. This bird does it perfectly. Neuroscience explains why. Animals that have their eyes on the side of their head are scanning the entire visual environment all the time. They're not focused on anything. Think your grazing animals, your cows, your sheep, your birds, etc. But think about a bird picking up seeds on the beach or on concrete. That bird's head is up here. It's up about a foot off the ground, or if it's a small bird, about six inches off the ground. And its eyes are on the side of its head, and yet it has this tiny beak that can quickly pick up these little seeds off the ground with immense precision. Now, if you try to do that by staring off to the sides of the room and picking up items in front of you with high precision at that tiny scale, little tiny objects, you will miss almost every time. They do it perfectly and they don't smash their beak into the ground and damage it. They do it with beautiful movement acuity also. So how do they do it? How do they create this focus or this awareness of what's in front of them? And it turns out as they lower their head, their eyes very briefly move inward in what's called a virgin's eye movement. Now, their eyes can't actually translocate in their head. They're fixed in the skull, just like yours and mine are. But when we move our eyes slightly inward, maybe you can tell that I'm doing it like, like so, basically shortening or, or making the interpupillary distance, as it's called, smaller, two things happen. Not only do we develop a smaller visual window into the world, but we activate a set of neurons in our brainstem that trigger the release of both norepinephrine, epinephrine, and acetylcholine.